This is Miss Maribel and Mr. Batsaw and I have just rescued her off a barbed wire fence. So unfortunately in Australia there are thousands and thousands of kilometres of barbed wire fences. So it's three strands of barbed wire atop a chain wire fence and it's used as so-called security fencing. But the problem is, is because the fences are so ugly, a lot of businesses plant native shrubbery next to them to try and hide their ugliness and they choose things like flowering bottle brushes or grevilleas so that's exactly what flying foxes what form flying foxes native diet so it's a bit of a catch-22 and it's quite disastrous anyway Maribel is heavily pregnant but she was very very gently caught on her wings so her prospects are good uh, the big problem now is just hoping that you're enjoying that juice, hoping that um, we don't lose the baby. But she was in the shade, so she wasn't in the bleating sun, and I don't think she only went on very early this morning, so she hasn't been on the wire for very long. And she's a really calm, lovely, calm girl, so I'm hoping that desperately that um, that equates to a successful live birth in the next couple of weeks, that she'll be in care. But for now it's the usual recipe of bed rest warmth, fluids, and um, we're about to start that process now, so just about to get her to bed. She's had some nice juice. Mm -hmm. Nice bed rest and mango today, and fingers crossed for your unborn baby.